next couple of hours um, so today is actually the last chance to get hold of some of the pieces that I have behind me um, I've done some really amazing price slashes we've got some amazing goodies coming up so I'm excited to get started guys um, say hello in the comments we have got Winnie moderating as well she's just finished her show and she's jumping on to help me with my show now um, so guys say hello in the comments let me know where you are tuning in from and today's gonna be a really fun packed show I'm gonna do some auctions we've got some like final final prices and this will be the last chance for you guys to get hold of a lot of the pieces that are behind me um hey daniela how are you okay almost 25 already 25 people on that's amazing um so guys this is a live show shopping experience you can shop all of the products that i have with me behind i'm going to showcase each product one by one and then once the item is ready for purchase there will be an icon in the top left hand corner of your screen that you can click on and it will take you straight through to the website where you can see all of the information that you need of course i'm here to answer any of your questions throughout the next couple of hours hey guys hey stevie sandy aku hi guys hey winnie um, we accept several payment methods. We accept credit, debit, and Amex. We accept PayPal, Apple Pay, and we even have a layaway option, which is called Split It. This is basically where you can split the total value of your order over the duration of up to 12 months. You do not have to wait to pay the item off. You can actually receive it literally within a couple of days, and then you just pay the item off over the course of 12 months. Um, for this particular way of payment, you do actually just have to have a credit card with the total order value available on the card. But apart from that, it's really easy. It takes just a couple of minutes to check out. Um, I'm just going to turn my phone on. Do not disturb. There we go. Um, and yeah, it's a great way to shop with us. Um, and obviously with those payment plans as well, just makes it feel slightly easier on the bank account. Um, we ship worldwide. We cover your customs and duties and shipping fees are anywhere between £10 and 35 pounds depending on where you're located it will work this out upon checkout um, i can see a couple of you are asking for hermes bags i do have a few with me in new york um, so if there are any in particular i know if it also for guys if it gets too loud let me know because i can just shut the window um, but yeah if there's any any hermes items in particular that you're looking for let me know in the comment box because i do have several with me and i'm happy to show them today i wanted to do kind of a last chance to get kind of show um, but if you do want me to show some Hermes bags I can just in front of me I've got you know Birkin 30s I've got an orange I've got a white and I've got a blue I've got a red um, I've also got some Kelly's as well and I do actually have a Kelly a uh, Birkin 25 in the color lime in swift leather which is also available so let me know guys um oh I do I have several mini Kelly's I've got Kelly 28s um, I think I've only got 20s and 28s actually and Almu I don't have any Chanel 19s unfortunately now I'm going to start the show actually with what I'm wearing. Um, I've actually um, got some really nice ready to wear pieces coming up over the next couple of weeks and I'm going to be wearing them during the show and then obviously give you guys an opportunity to purchase them as well. So the first item I'm actually going to start with is this Chanel sweater. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, it's in grey cashmere and then you'll see it's got like antique um, gold buttons and I wear a US 4 and it fits me perfectly I would say I'd say it's a slight cropped fit it sits just into the waist um, and yeah I've gone for this with leggings today if you guys want to get hold of this sweater we can get it pinned when it is in the collection um, so as I mentioned guys I'm going to be wearing pieces that are readily available to shop with us at Luxury Promise and show you guys how I style them and and hopefully give you guys some inspo uh, but we will get this pinned it is a i'd say up to a us6 which is a uk10 i think the sizing will be perfect for that kind of size um, and it has the kind of double breasted front you've got two buttons on each side and it's kind of like a wrap around cardigan as well how nice is this stevie i know it's, it's so comfortable um and a really nice mm -hmm. color as well i'm so into um i'm so into gray at the moment and it's sophie's fault she's got me into all the grays um, so once that is pinned, you guys can have access to this and then we'll move on to some of the bags behind me. I've got around 10 jewellery pieces and I'm going to auction lots of things today. I want to have a fun show. I'm going to be live for probably two hours. I want to have a really fun show. I want to give you guys the best prices and deals possible. And this will be, you know, the last opportunity for you guys to get your hands on some of the pieces behind me. We've got new stock coming in Monday and over the next couple of weeks, guys, loads of stock coming in New York. So it's going to be an amazing month live from New York. Lots of auctions. Echo, yes. Um, so I'll just wait for this to be pinned and we will get started with some of the bags. But how nice is that? I've just paired it with a black tank top underneath and black leggings. Um, 
and then there will be an icon in that top left hand corner hey everyone on instagram head over to luxurypromise.com gonna wait for this to be pinned where are you guys tuning in from let me know i also want to get some feedback actually on um timings for the us i booked myself in for shows between 4 30 and 6 30 p.m every day on the website that's eastern time um, but if that if that works for you guys, let me know. And if you do want any later shows as well, I did a later show Friday. It was a bit quiet. Um, but if you do want slightly later shows as well, just let me know. So this is 100% cashmere. It's £795 and it's US dollars and it is pinned. Winnie's just popped a picture of me in it. <laughs> she screenshot a picture of me in it and it's pinned in that top left-hand corner, guys. If you want to buy what I'm wearing today, just click on that icon. Hey, Sabrina. Okay, I'm gonna get started. I'm gonna start with some earrings. Let's do some earrings first. Hey, Cal. Hey, Dee. Don't worry, if we do end up doing a pop-up, we will let you know um, further details on that. We're still working on it. But yeah, wow, we've got 80 people on here already. Okay, um, the first pair I'm gonna start with, Winnie, I'll give you the code, is ASL3897. And these are a pair of 1994 Chanel clip-on earrings. They are 24 karat gold and they're in a very good condition. I would say just some light tarnishing, but no significant signs of wear. The gold is still nice and bright and shiny. And they do have that slightly antique finish, which I, I actually really like um, in comparison to the really shiny pieces. Uh, what you'll see is that big CC logo to the front. I know you guys all want a pop-up. I know we are trying. We're really, really trying to uh, find a good spot. Um, so these are 24 karat gold, 1994. They've got that big CC logo on the front and they're a perfect size, in my opinion, for kind of every day. Um, I love a pair of earrings that you can dress up and down. And this is what they would look like on 85 people, guys. Welcome. Um, this is what they would look like on. They're in, you know, excellent condition. They're a really, really beautiful, um, you know, daytime and evening pair. You can dress them up and down. Now we've got some crazy prices today. So if you guys are in the mood to shop, get ready. Um, honestly, I'm really excited about the pieces and the prices that we've got available on the show today. So we'll get these pinned. As mentioned, they're in very good condition. Hey Shahina, and they've got that nice CC logo at the front. They are 1994 antique gold with really beautiful um, fine details. You'll see here the the, the metal work on these are absolutely stunning. <laughs> oh Shahina, hope you're well. Aren't they beautiful? Hey Ada, how are you? I feel like I haven't seen you for a while. I know, guys. Just let me know if the um, the noise gets a bit too much. I'll shut the window. Um, okay, these are 500, guys, the prices today are amazing, 550 pounds, which is 676 US dollars. We are covering your customs and your duties, and we ship worldwide. These are pinned in that top left-hand corner. Usually we'd sell these for around 695 to 750, but I'm feeling generous today, guys, and I want you guys to get your hands on some amazing pieces. Um, so there we go. By the way, share the live away, guys. We're going to have loads coming up soon. We're nearly at 100 viewers. So as soon as we hit 100, I want to start doing some auctions. Um, but in the meantime, these are pinned in that top left-hand corner. And if you do have any questions about these, then let me know in that comment box. I'm just going to quickly add on to the Instagram live to head over to luxurypromise.com um, so everyone can tune in. Okay, we are live from New York. Right, that is pinned. Um, Shahina, this is available, okay? This is, uh, we actually, I showed this as the first item. It's a size medium, it's gray cashmere, and it's actually Chanel, and it's pinned in that top left-hand corner. The price was amazing, 795. It's a cardigan that wraps around. Um, and it's slight, just sits slightly above the hip as, um, as well, which is really nice, especially when you wear like tailored trousers and denim. Um, so if you want to get hold of what I'm wearing, you can shop these pieces today. Um, those have been pinned. I want to do an auction. Let's go for it. Um, let's do an auction. Charlotte, these are studs. So the majority of vintage earrings, um, they are they are clip-ons. Sorry, did I say stud? I meant clip-ons. Um, clip-ons are, you know, the most common style of earring from, you know, the vin like back in the day vintage, especially like 80s, 90s quite hard to get your hands on stud earrings that are vintage okay so 
Let's do an auction of a really special piece. Um, hi everyone, hey Kel, how are you? Okay, Winnie, the first auction item today, I want to do ASL 3919. When it comes to collectible pieces, especially with you know Chanel vintage jewelry, when you get something with lots of medallions and lots of logos and symbols, generally speaking, they are the ones to get, okay? Uh, you guys are coming off Van Island with me today. <laughs> um, now this particular piece here is an 80s Chanel charm bracelet. Um, it's absolutely stunning. And what you'll notice is it's actually got the, um, the letter stamping that can be used to seal the wax on, um, you know, how amazing is this one, eh? Um, that can be used to seal the wax on a letter. Um, you've also got these Chanel kind of dog tags as well that show the Chanel Rue Cambon address. This was Chanel's first address um, in Paris. And this is 24 karat gold. It's from the 90s, which means, you know, it's gilded in 24 karat gold. We're going to auction this today, guys. So you're going to really get some unbeatable prices. Um, this has like a hook and lock, which you can use to fasten the bracelet. And when this sits on the wrist, the charms just sit so effort effortlessly against the wrist. Um, let me show you. This is such a statement and it's also so beautiful. So you'll see, I have really small wrists, so I'll give you guys a measurement, but this is how the bracelet sits around the wrist. You get that beautiful bling, that bright gold shine. It's absolutely stunning. And there's minimal tarnish on this piece. So I'll get you guys the length and then we're gonna set the auction price in the comments. And if you guys are new to our auctions, they're super fun and exciting. It's an opportunity for you guys to place your highest bids of what you want to pay on the item. And you have two minutes. Actually, I'm going to do a minute and a half today because I want to keep this show moving. I've got lots to get through. It's a nine inch length. But with that hook, you can, you know, you can shorten, um, shorten this if you wanted to as well for a slightly more snug fit. So we're going to set the price in the comments. Um, Anessa, I wouldn't say it's too big because you've got that nice big hook here. So you can actually just, you know, hook it to any point. So it's kind of a one size fits all. <laughs> um, and then yeah there's the shipping fees guys so how this is going to work is we're going to set the I'm going to set the timer on my screen to a minute and a half Winnie's going to let us know the auction price in the comments and then you guys can bid in the comments whoever is my highest bidder on my screen at the end of the uh, minute and a half uh, wins the dibs on this item and then you have 10 minutes to check out I'd like to work in increments of £20, please. So when you are bidding, just make sure you're bidding £20 higher than the previous, otherwise your bid won't be counted. Winnie, if you could let us know the auction price, please, the starting bids. I know, we're at 100 viewers, guys, on a Sunday evening. Welcome, welcome. We're going to set the auction price in the comments, and we're going to get this show on the road. This is beautiful, though. Like this is such a collector's item. Like gen genuinely, this is, you know, something so special. I think everybody would, you know, love and enjoy to wear this. You could even, I've seen some people add chain extenders. You can turn them into chokers. Um, but because it's 80s and excellent condition, you know, it's a really, really beautiful collector's piece in an excellent condition. And you've got all of those beautiful charms as well. I absolutely love the wax stamps. I think they're stunning. Winnie, if you could let us know the auction price, please. That would be amazing. And we'll get this. Okay, there we go. So I'm starting my timer now, guys. You've got a minute and a half to place your bids. We have our starting bid price at £500 for an 80s Chanel charm bracelet. £500. Remember, guys, this is 24 karat gold. This is, you know, a lot of gold for that price. It's super collectible. Okay, here we go. So Chrissy's in at 500. Tanya's straight in at 600. So guys, we're at 600 pounds with Tanya. You guys have got a minute to bid and then my highest bidder on my screen wins dibs to purchase this item. It's in an excellent condition. Um, it's from the 80s. It's got these beautiful charms. And I mean, just what a collector's piece to have. Danica, it is adjustable, yes, because you have this nice big hook here. And if you look closely throughout the bracelet, you can actually just attach it to any part of the link. So it's nine inches in length at, at its biggest size, but you can adjust it. Meggie, we need bids are higher than 620 pounds in order to count. You guys have got 30 seconds left. 
back to bid. Currently our highest bidder is um, Tanya at £600. You guys have got 25 seconds to get in there with this. This is, uh, honestly, that price is it, ridiculous. Like I've seen these sell for, you know, 900, 1,000, 1,100. Um, really, this is such a collector's piece. You guys have got 10 seconds. I'm gonna start my countdown. We've got 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, I know, echo, one, and then I have to just give five seconds for the delay on my screen. Okay, Chrissy is the winner at 620 pounds. Congratulations, Chrissy, you are the winner. So what we're going to do is we're going to adjust the price to £620. We will have it pinned in this top left-hand corner. And then you have 10 minutes to check out. If you do not check out, then Tanya will be the next person able to check out on this piece. Congratulations, Chrissy, £620. Honestly, that price for this is insane. Okay. Let's move on. Um, I'm gonna do a bag next. We're gonna move on to a real classic. Um, this is a black lamb skin, kind of like a small mini flat bag from Chanel. Um, this is gilded with 24 karat gold. And honestly, the condition of this is absolutely beautiful. Now, this has a nice CC turn lock to the front. I'm just gonna turn the light down very slightly. Nice CC turn lock at the front. And then we've got leather entwined gold chain. Now, just so you guys know, I have done price reductions on everything today. So stay tuned. We've got so much more to come. We've got over 100 people on here on a Saturday, sorry, a Sunday evening. Um, this is a single flap. And what I really like actually is the rounded edge on the CC turn lock to the front. Something slightly more different, slightly more elevated. And then the inside is actually lined with burgundy lambskin. This has one single chain as a drop. It also comes with its original card and is a one series. So this is a 1989, wow, 1989 Chanel single flap in a really nice small size and it's in an excellent condition. Now I'll show you the base. We've got some, maybe some light hairline scratches. Corners are nice and clean. And the leather is nice and puffy and soft as well towards the front. I would give this, you know, a, a nice eight out of 10 condition rating. It's a really beautiful bag, such a classic and very much like the classic flat, but just slightly different. If you want something, you know, that still looks classic, still looks very elegant and collectible from Chanel, but you want something, you know, just slightly different. I think this is a really great option. I really like the style of the flap to the front, something slightly more unique and wait till you see the price of this guys just to confirm it's a one series with its original card it's crafted from lambskin this is a 1989 lambskin small classic flap with 24 karat gold single chain drop for a nice long crossbody which sits around the hip and i'm five foot eleven just to give you guys a um you know kind of a size reference i'm 5 11 so generally speaking if you are slightly smaller than me then the um, bag will sit slightly lower as well so just bear that in mind me too cow i really love this style of lock to the front nice plain black leather to the back there we go okay and we're ready for the price it's so beautiful yeah, it's nice. It's a nice height. I, um, oh, D, do you mean uh, like I have a nice height or the bag sits at a nice height? <laughs> um, we also need to get that, that bracelet pinned in that top left hand corner. So um, our winner of the auction can check out. She's got 10 minutes to do so. Now, this price is really really amazing i've done this for 2995 pounds today for a one series classic flap with a card and um, that's 3683 us dollars plus we're covering your customs and your duties guys we ship worldwide shipping fees vary depending on where you're located in the world if you guys want to get your hands on a 1989 chanel classic for under three thousand pounds you can do so by clicking on that link, which is in the top left-hand corner. Have a look, there's more information and images. If you guys have any questions, let me know. But this is a real steal on this. That is actually around the same price as a wallet on chain in the store current season. Um, 
amazing thank you so much Winnie. that's amazing and chrissy the bracelet is pinned in that top left hand corner this is such a good price guys grab it whilst you can you can also use split it and split it over 12 months and split that payment coming out of your bank account now let's do the laporza because i know i've seen a few of you interested in this this might well be one of my favorite bags actually that we have in stock currently in New York. Um, I love it. I think it's, you know, very different. It's a slightly more current season piece and it's such a collectible bag. This is from a cruise, collect cruise collection and is a black and white combination. As you can see, this is a rounded style. We've got the, the La Posa um, logo to the top, Chanel here, and then we've got the CEC logos on each side. You'll notice just one mark to the front of the bag here. Um, but apart from that, the bag is in really good condition. It's a monochrome finish. Um, oh, thank you, Dee. And then we've got this black and white canvas, like entwining, which goes through the champagne gold hardware strap. You'll notice that the, the strap kind of weaves in and out of the bag as well, which I think is beautiful. This is a 2019 bag. So when we're looking at, you know, collectible items and collectible years, this was actually Karl Lagerfeld's last year at Chanel, which would, you know, indicate that this is a really great bag to invest in. I mean, it's stunning anyway, but it's a great bag to invest in. Um, inside is a really good condition. It's a kind of like a light, light lambskin, minimal wear. I would I would give this probably, you know, a seven and a half, eight out of 10 in condition. The back is nice and clean. So there's minimal transfer to the back, which is great. And I know Sandy, how stunning is this? Now, this is obviously from a cruise collection, which is usually seen in like March, April time, um, which indicates this is more of like a summery style bag. But I actually love this for the winter as well. I think it's a really fun way um, to dress up your outfits. And it's just a really fun, unique bag to have in your collection. You'll see the PVC front is um, nice and clear. There's no dullness or like, um, it's not like, I'd say like steamed up, which is great. And you can see straight through it into that nice big CC stitch at the front this is what it looks like on it's a nice long drop it's absolutely beautiful and i love it i absolutely love it so what we'll do is we'll get this pinned and we'll get the price up this is such a collectible piece from 2019 cruise collection la Posa. and um, this is 2595 pounds which is 3191 usd Generally speaking, when you get these more unique pieces, such as, you know, the rounded shapes, you see, you know, the love hearts, the vanities, um, this is unique. And you always, always tend to see that these prices only go up and up and up. They tend to be really great investment pieces. Like I mentioned, this was the last year of Karl Lagerfeld's reign at Chanel. Um, so that would indicate that this is just a really great collector's piece to have in your collection as well. So if you want to get your hands on this, guys, click on the icon in that top left-hand corner. And if you do have any questions at any point, let me know in that comment box such a fun bag a really great way to have you know a unique style and a great one to add to your collection now i'm going to keep going with the auctions i'm really into the auctions at the moment and we're going to do lots of them today so i'm going to auction a bag next i think um great price on this right guys really really great price um really fun bag to have and um yeah so let's do another auction I'm going to auction something that comes with a box because I want, as I've mentioned, I want you guys to get your hands on some great pieces today. I believe the um, the Chanel um, bracelet has checked out. So congratulations on that purchase. You won that at an amazing price. I'm going to auction something pink, something pretty and something that comes with a box. So it would potentially make a great gift as well. This comes with a box and a dust bag. And the bag I am referring to is actually a wallet on chain. So the wallet on chain from Chanel is probably one of the most classic and iconic bags. I feel like the wallet on chain is something everybody has to have one wallet on chain in their collection. They're great day to night pieces. They're compact, they're lightweight, they're easy to style. I do win it, yeah, it's PXL1876. And this particular one here is in a beautiful, beautiful baby pink. It's almost like a milkshake to me. It has that creamy undertone. It's lambskin, so it has that nice, shiny, puffy look. And we actually have a silver hardware combination to this bag, which is really great for, um, I think it's particularly against pink. I think silver looks beautiful. Now the wallet on chain always features a back pocket. This is great for business cards, maybe a small set of keys, something you like to you know, easily access. 
And then the bag is actually um, a single flap, which opens up into several compartments for cards, coins, and cash. You can also fit a set of keys, a lipstick, and a phone in here. So it's that perfect compact style piece that is great for day and night. Saba, how beautiful is this color? You guys know me so well. I don't tend to like be drawn towards pink, but when you get that really nice kind of strawberry milkshake, creamy, creamy pink, I'm, I have to say, I really, really love it. Especially against grays and blacks. I think it's a really beautiful color. And the wallet on chain you can wear in so, so many ways. Me and Sabrina had like a styling session with one of the store assistants in Heathrow Airport in Chanel. Um, Jojo, yes, that brings me on to this point. So this bag, I have to, I have to obviously be clear with you guys. It has been slightly touched up, which basically means it has been repainted slightly. This will have been factored into the pricing of the item. We're also going to auction this as well. So the starting bid is going to be absolutely amazing. But just to confirm, it comes with a box. It comes with a dust bag. Um, and the whoever re repainted this actually did a really, really amazing job. We're always very transparent with you guys. If something has been repainted, and uh, we will tell you and obviously we'll give you our honest opinion on how how well of a job we think that they've done the pink matches there's no um there's no like um difference with the color you can barely even notice it and the leather is still nice and soft as well i'll give you a good close-up of the bag because you can see that the pink matches perfectly. The leather is still shiny. It hasn't, they haven't used like dry paint. To be honest, I think it's just the corners. But again, I'm, I'm saying this is like very, very minimal touch up. Um, I think it's just the corners. But to be honest, you know, I, I can't even really see myself actually where it's been done. I, actually, I can. It's just the corners here. Can you see that? Just, just the corner, it's very, very minimal and we will factor that into the starting bid as well. Now, what we'll do is we'll get the starting bid price up on the screen and then during the minute and a half, I'll show you guys how you can style this. But just confirming once again, it comes with a box and the dust bag. Maya, I love this too as well. How beautiful is it? Um, beautiful, classic wallet on chain from Chanel. The year, I'll give you the year. It's a 16 series. It's a 16 series, guys, which is a 2012. So I think we're ready. We're gonna start, oh, thanks, Winnie. We're gonna start the bid in um, very shortly, and we're gonna do a minute and a half. You guys, again, if you have just tuned in, we're going to do an auction on this piece. We are going to work in increments of, um, let me think, tw uh, we can do uh, 50 pounds on this bag. Increments of £50 in your auction bidding. It doesn't come with a card, Saba. It comes just with its um, box, dust bag, and has its authenticity co um, like code inside as well. So it doesn't come with its card, but it has everything apart from. Um, does touch-ups affect resale value? It can do, Nina, yes. Um, again, we're always very transparent, it can do. Just generally speaking, the wallet on chain sells for uh, around 3000 and the price will be, I think, just just over half for this bag. So we have taken that into consideration. The touch-ups cannot be seen. They did a really good job on it, actually. But like Echo, I agree. If you're buying this to keep it, then you know it's not it's not going to make a difference. So Winnie's going to let us know the starting bid in the comments, and you guys can get cracking with those bids. Yeah, exactly, Winnie. As long as they did a good job on it. Um, honestly, we've we've seen some real messes when it comes to touch-ups. This is really great. Like, sometimes they don't even match the colour properly. Like, sometimes it can be terrible, to be honest. But this is a really, really, you know, a good piece of work that they've done. So, we're going to wait for the auction price. And we're going to get started. And I'm going to show you guys what to do. So... £1,700, the timer starts now. You guys have got a minute and a half to bid for this pink wallet on chain. Estimated value is around £3,000. Janine, I would rate the condition probably like a nine out of 10. There's no corner wear, there's no discoloration, there's no wear to the inside. It's a you know very excellent condition piece. Um, we're going to start the bids at 1700. Mary's our first bid at 1700 pounds. And I'm gonna show you guys what you can do with this bag. Keep sending your bids. I'm gonna keep an eye out on the timer. You guys have got um, around a minute left. So the wallet on chain is designed to sit slightly lower. 
when you wear it as a single, a single chain crossbody. Once you double the chain up underneath the flap, you can create either a slightly shorter chain to wear as a cross, or you can, you know, use this as a shoulder bag. Um, you guys on Instagram, if you can head over to luxurypromise.com, we're live there. Okay, guys, we've got around 35 seconds left. So this is what it looks like over the shoulder. And then you can also, of course, even out those chains and style this as a shoulder bag as well. The wallet on chain is a perfect day to night bag. Okay, guys, you've got the, uh, 20 seconds and I'm gonna start my countdown in five seconds, okay? Our highest bid currently is Mary at 1800. I'm gonna start my 10 second countdown now. We've got 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And then I'm gonna just give you guys a couple of seconds because I know there's a, there's about a 10, 15 second delay just as Stevie said. So yeah, I'm gonna give it just five seconds. Okay, that's it guys. Mary is our winner, 1800 pounds for this pink lambskin wallet on chain, Mary. You may have got the deal of the day there. Congratulations. So we're gonna set the price at 1800 pounds. Once that has been set, you have 10 minutes to check out. Mary, that is such an amazing price. I'm so happy for you. Congratulations, 1800 pounds for a wallet on chain. Such an insane deal. Huge congratulations. You've got 10 minutes to check out. Amazing deal on that one. Congrats. So let's keep moving. Um, I want to do, to be honest, I want to auction everything, but I don't know. <laughs> Let's do another one. I, I want to do another auction. Okay. Now this bag coming up, the SKU uh, winning is ASL 1929. Uh, 1, this is actually one of the only, and uh, I think one of the only Navy caviar tote bags I think I've ever seen. This is Navy caviar and it's actually vintage. So you've got that really bright 24 karat gold hardware on this bag. Um, I do have classic flaps in these. So yeah, I have one in light pink. I have one in black. Um, I have this one here again in black. Slightly different look, but yeah, I do. Um, and I've got some jumbos as well coming up also. So this is navy caviar. It's in, I would say, a very good condition. We've got just one scratch across the front here. It's a small um, small hairline scratch. We can auction the Speedy Marina. Yeah, sure, we can do that. Um, and then we've got the 24 karat gold. Now this bag here is probably one of my favorite styles of bags from Chanel in terms of like an everyday style. It also comes with beige straps as well. So you can actually you know, have two looks with this. It comes with beige straps and it also comes with the navy as well. So you can play around with, um, you know, the kind of style that you want and the look that you want. Uh, I don't have any Kelly to go, Zoe, no. Sorry about that, I really don't. Um, these usually are between like a three series and a five series. So I just want to double check the serial code on this so I can tell you guys the year. How good is this? Okay, we've got a card as well. It's actually a two series. So this is 1991 Chanel Caviar in Navy. We really, really do not see this often at all. Another great thing about this bag is it actually sits perfectly as a crossbody. It's a slightly higher cross, but again, remember I'm 5'11". It sits nicely under the chest and it is quite comfortable as well. Um, so yeah, this is in really excellent condition. Minimal corner wear. Um, barely any corner wear actually and nice even navy tones inside is lambskin and i would give this an eight out of ten condition you've also got pockets to the front here and also to the back as well and just so you guys are aware it also comes with beige straps for a slightly more unique look um i'll give you the measurements lindy read my mind here are the measurements this is a 12 and a half inch and then the height is 10 so it's 12 and a half inches by 10 inches it's three nil to us three nil to england wow 
Guys, I wish I was watching the game. I'm glad I'm here with you all, but I really wish I was watching the England game today. Um, okay. Shipping within the US is £10, Jazz. It's really, um, and it's really quick as well, just £10. So we're going to auction it. We're going to do lots of auctions today. Winnie's going to, again, let us know the auction um, bids. And we're going to start. You guys have got a minute and a half, okay? I might even cut the auction times down to a minute. Um, yeah, I'm going to cut the auction times down to a minute today because I want to auction a lot. And I want you guys to get your hands on these pieces uh, as quickly and as the, at the best price as possible. So we're going to auction this piece, guys. 1991. Chanel um, navy caviar with 24 karat gold, comes with a card and additional straps, 12 and a half inches by 10 inches. And let's get the price up. Let's do it, let's do another auction. Oh, apologies, uh, shipping is 15 pounds with UPS. Okay, starting bid on this bag, ladies and gentlemen, is 2,200 pounds. And I'm starting my countdown now. I'm only doing a minute this time. I wanna get these auctions happening quickly. I want your bids in. Remember, there's a slight delay, guys. I don't want you to miss out. Start sending your auctions in now. 2,200 is the starting bid for this navy tote bag. Shipping to the UK could be up to 35 pounds, Michelle, but we are obviously covering your customs and duties. So you do save us, save several hundred pounds by shopping on the live shows. You guys have got uh, just over 30 seconds to place bids. This is what it would look like with the beige. Okay, 30 seconds, guys, to place a bid. 2,200 pounds for this navy caviar tote bag which goes crossbody as well remember it's a great everyday bag it's a great crossbody okay no one wants the navy today 10 seconds i'm going to do a countdown anyway we've got 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 okay so what we're gonna do is we're going to set this live at 2,200 pounds. And if anybody wants to grab that, they can grab that on today's show at 2,200 pounds. Let's keep moving guys, loads more to come. I'm gonna do a, another box Chanel bag next. I believe the wallet on chain has sold and the order has been received. So congratulations to whoever got that. Um, Marina wants us to auction the Speedy. Marina, can I ask if, if you want me to auction the Navy or you want me to do the um, limited edition one at the base? Just let me know. In the meantime, I'm going to show you guys what I have in this box. Oh, this is a great one. So coming up, we have a boxed Chanel bag, which comes with its original cards and it comes with um, a box. So it makes a great gift. It also comes with it's dust bag and it's authenticity card. This is a 31 series. So this is a relatively new Chanel bag. For me, this is such a great piece for day and for evening. I absolutely love the pearl details to each side on this bag. Um, this is like a, I can show that next for you, Shahina, yeah. Uh, navy, sure, Marina, I can do that for you. This is a black, uh, black leather quilted. We've got a matte gold finish, and then we've got a combination of, on the strap of pearls down the front. Um, Lydia, the, the navy bag has a magnetic uh, pop block closure. So it has a closure at the top. 2021 bag, this has a magnetic closure to the front. It has a matte, matte leather, which is beautiful. And then the inside lining is like a red canvas. This comes with everything. So this is a full set. It's also in excellent, excellent condition. So you can see there's no, you know, no significant signs of wear to the base. Corners are nice and clean. And it's a really nice size crossbody. Now, for me, this bag is all about the pearls, the way that they sit as a crossbody, the way that they sit down the side of the bag. I think this is, you know, such an elegant and unique piece to get. It's also a great size, it's quite compact. You know, it's gonna fit your phone, it's going to fit a wallet and, you know, a set of keys and your other small essentials as well. And we even have a back pocket here. Just wanna show you again, close up on the condition because condition is really excellent. Minimal signs of wear, there's no signs of wear to the inside and the pearls have no peeling or cracking. They're in an excellent condition. You'll also notice on the sides, we've got two 
gold pearls, which have a CC logo. So I'm not gonna auction this. I'm gonna just give you guys the best, best price that we can do. It's coming as a full set, so it would be perfectly giftable for a Christmas present. But obviously, if you guys are here to shop for yourselves, you, you can see how stunning this is. Um, it sits really nicely over the shoulder. Wow, these pearls look beautiful. I love the pearls on this. Pearls are very, you know, classic, very iconic for the house of Chanel. And I think this bag really does have it all, to be honest. Um, nice comfort strap to the shoulder. And when Winnie's ready, she's gonna get this live and you guys can shop away. So just to confirm, we're covering your customs and duties for the whole show. We're shipping worldwide. Items will be shipped within a matter of days and shipping's really quick, really, uh, really fast. Matte gold finish, hardware coming as a full set. Isn't it beautiful? I knew you guys would love this. As soon as I saw it, I was like, wow, this bag is stunning. It's all about the pearls for me. It's not, it's not snowing, Cheryl, no. It's actually not as cold as what I thought it would have been. Um, it's just as cold as London, to be honest. London's been freezing, but here is, yeah, it just, it feels like London at the moment, but I, I can imagine it's only gonna get colder over the next couple of weeks, I'm sure. Okay, we're gonna get this pinned. And if you guys also want to get hold of the jacket I'm wearing or the cardigan, it's Cashmere by Chanel. Um, it's available under the handbag icon at the bottom part of your screen. Now guys, the price of this is fantastic. It's a 2021 bag coming with everything, card, dust bag and box, full set, pristine condition. It's 3,250 pounds, which is 3,997 US dollars. We're gonna cover your customs and duties. And if you want to get your hands on this bag, you know what to do. Just click on that icon, which is pinned in that top left-hand corner. It's such a beautiful bag. And something so unique as well, you know, I think this is something that not many people will have. Um, definitely a conversation starter and has all of those classical elements that everybody wants in a Chanel bag. So really, really great one to get, guys. Okay, now I'm going to do the Speedy for Marina. We're going to auction this. This is actually um, more of a current season, more of a current season speedy bag from Louis Vuitton. This is in the Empriente leather, which is um, embossed with the monogram logo. And this is a red and, red and navy blue combination. So we've got navy blue leather, and then you'll notice the trimmings on the bag are red. So you have those small subtle hints of red, but you know, the bag is just a classic navy. The inside is lined with canvas, it's pinstriped, and this has a gold hardware finish. The condition of this is pristine. There's nowhere to the inside, there's nowhere to the base, or the corners, and every part of the bag is in an excellent condition. It's got a nice crossbody as well, so it sits nicely against the body, and then obviously you've got those nice top handles as well that you can style the bag into the crook of your arm, just here. It's coming with a keen clochette, and it even has additional pockets to the front as well. So the front has uh, additional pockets, which are also lined with the red canvas. Now, Marina, this is a more, more of a current season Louis Vuitton. Um, so I'm not quite sure how much room we've got in the pricing, but we'll do our best to auction this. Um, the sizing of this is a 25, actually. It's, it's class as the mini. Let me show you. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's marked as a 25. It measures around 26, but it's classed as the mini, uh, as a 25 centimeter speedy. Um, so again, guys, we're gonna keep these auctions nice and quick because I wanna get through everything today. Um, the auction is going to be one minute long and you can just submit your maximum highest price that you'd like to pay for the bag. And, and then obviously at the end of the one minute, whoever is my last bid, highest bid on screen, wins the bag at that price. Thanks, Winnie. Yeah, I think there's a real delay actually today on here. So I'm hopefully up to date with you guys in the comments and everything. Let's do this. Let's get the auction price up. I actually really love the like red details on this. I think they're really beautiful. We're going to start the auction at 
1650 pounds 1650 pounds this is a you know a new season full leather speedy 25 in navy i'm starting my countdown now guys you've got one minute to place bids for this beautiful bag something that would have retailed for way over um two thousand pounds and it's barely even been used i'd actually go as far as saying it hasn't been used you guys have got 45 seconds to place your bids for the navy leather speedy 1650 pounds is our starting bid and you guys have got 35 seconds left to place your bids remember we cover your customs and duties we are going to be shipping worldwide and it's an absolutely beautiful new season Louboutin Speedy in navy leather. You guys have got just over 20 seconds to place your bids. Please remember the delays. If you are thinking of placing a bid, make sure to do it sooner rather than later. So once the time is up, you guys don't miss out. Okay, I'm gonna start my 10 second countdown. We've got 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, nobody wants a speedy. What we'll do is we'll set the price at 16.50 and if anybody wants to get their hands on this, they can do. Um, can you show the Chanel, show the Chanel medium classic when you get a chance? I don't have a medium classic on the show, Sandy, but I do have one which I showed, I showed it Friday, but I'm happy to quickly show you it again if you wanted to see it. Hey Anna, how are you? Um, okay, let's keep moving. I'm gonna move on to a camera bag. Do you have any classic Chanel Jumbo? Chelsea, I do. I'll move on to that next for you. This is a really, really amazing bag. Um, it's coming with its box and is a Jumbo. It is with silver hardware and it's crafted from black lambskin. Now the skew of this, Winnie is ASL 3095. This is a Chanel jumbo flat bag with palladium hardware. It's a single flap. If you guys um, have tried on the double or the single, I would say the only difference between a single flap and a double flap is the single is very slightly lighter. Um, so it can be, you know, slightly more comfortable to carry, but there's really not much difference. This also comes with its dust bag. It comes with its care booklet and it comes with its cards. We have a full set situation here. This is a nine series and a nine series is uh, like late 2000, I think it might be 2012 or no, no, just before that actually. Um, I think Winnie will put it in the comments anyway, but yeah, um, early 2000s, black lambskin with palladium hardware with a black lambskin interior. This is in a very good condition. I would say just some slight dullness to the leather on the corners, but overall, I'd still give it a good eight out of 10 condition. Oh, thank you. I was way off, Winnie. Thank you. Uh, 2004, 2005, in really, really great condition inside is also in a, in a great condition and we've got several pockets to the inside as well as well um this sits as a perfect shoulder bag the price will be set on this one guys i'm not going to do an auction perfect as a shoulder bag can also be adjusted to go as a crossbody um generally with the, the uh, jumbos the chains tend to be a lot longer so when you wear it as a crossbody they do sit nice and low and quite casual but you can actually just pull this up and um hang it nicely over the front as well um oh kimberly nice choice ruthenium hardware reissue if i come across one you'll be the first to know send me an email at grace at luxurypromise.com and i can see what i can find for you so just to confirm, guys, this is a full set, nine series, Chanel Jumbo Classic Flap in black lambskin. We've got a silver hardware finish, single flap, eight out of 10 condition, minimal wear, slight dullness to the corners. And when Winnie's ready, we're going to get the price up. No worries, Marina. Thank you for letting me know. Beautiful. This is, I mean, this is like the it bag right now that black and silver combination is really really what everyone's after um it is um, um honestly i absolutely love the jumbo i also find it's a great size for day and night this price is 
insane we, guys this is amazing this is you know a seven and a half thousand pound bag in store today you can get it with us for three thousand nine hundred ninety five pounds and get your customs and duties covered. You will not find this price again, let me tell you. These are so hard to get in now, guys, at great prices because of the constant increases with Chanel. Really, the prices just go up and up and up and up. This is 3995 pounds, and in dollars, that's 4,913. Right, guys, insane price. If you want to get your hands on this, click on that handbag icon, which is pinned in that top left-hand corner and grab this guys you can also you split it on this as well great great price something that we will probably not be able to honor again somebody should get this they really should let's do the bucket bag next shaheen if you're still here let's move on to the bucket bag bucket bag is for me one of those like cool girl styles um it's a great everyday bag um really comfortable to wear and just something a little bit different in comparison to those cut you know classic tote bags and classic crossbodies this particular one here is in um, black caviar leather we've got cc logos all the way around the edging and then we have a 24 karat gold hardware finish so it is vintage now, what I love about the bucket bags is they do generally come with a small pouch, which can be put inside the bag. It's also attached as well. So nice and secure for your valuables. Um, and this also, have a look at the inside. This also comes with its card and its care booklet, and it is a four series. This is a 1996 to 1997 Chanel bucket bag in black caviar. Inside is canvas really really beautiful beautiful condition on this bag you can see you've got that nice drawstring at the top corners are slightly worn i wouldn't say um you know i wouldn't say significant wear i think to the naked eye it's quite minimal sometimes the leather will go just slightly dull it won't necessarily look like it's been worn or scuffed um but these are slightly dull corners as well so just just i'd say just some wear to the piping but the corners itself you know are great i'd still give this a nice seven and a half eight out of uh, eight out of ten condition bag and let me show you what this looks like on now with the buckets they have a nice long strap and they generally sit just above the hip or just on the hip with that drawstring at the top it allows you to style the bag more compact or more open and relaxed so you know sometimes you might feel like just having the bag nice and open and easy to get inside and then maybe when you've got your valuables inside as well you can close that for a nice secure finish with that drawstring top and it brings it in slightly at the top as well just to confirm guys it's coming with its card and care booklet it's in really really great oh we won amazing thanks danica for letting me know really excellent condition um bag apart from the light corner wear caviar 1996 with 24 karat gold and i think we're ready for the price winnie thank you i love the bucket bags i do have an alma stevie i'll move on to uh, stephanie sorry i'll move on to that next for you it's the pm size let's get the price up of this first nice just over the shoulder so so easy to wear and they just look great, honestly. And they're so easy to get in and out of. Um, I just love them. And I love the fact that they have a nice wide base as well because you can fit so much inside. That price, <laughs> £1,995, which is 2,453 US dollars. Under 2,000 for a black caviar bucket bag, guys. Again, a price you'll not see again. We are doing the best, best prices possible today. This is almost like a clearance before I bring lots of new pieces in next week. Grab this whilst you can at that price, £1,995. And we're going to get it pinned in that top left-hand corner. Oh, it's just been pinned up there. Jazz, I do have Birkin 30s. I wasn't planning on showing them today as I have an Hermes show on Tuesday. But if there are any colours in particular you're looking for, let me know and I can um, maybe show you a couple. That has been pinned. Shahina, let me know if you've got any other questions about that. Let's move on to another great day bag. Actually, no, let's do another auction. Let's do an auction. Okay. 
I'm going to do an auction, guys, on a pair of earrings. This is PXL1294. PXL1294. Up next, I have a boxed gift. So potentially a great stocking filler or a Christmas present for somebody in your life or for yourself, of course. Um, I don't have any black and gold jumbos, unfortunately, Chelsea. I've only got... Oh, actually, Chelsea, are you open to... Um, are you open to the big vintage ones with the big CC logos? Oh, I have one right here. <laughs> Chelsea, I have one right here. I'm going to do these earrings and I'm going to move on to this piece behind me. Um, oh, Shahina, at that price, I honestly, like, I never push anyone for sales, but that price is amazing. Um, for caviar black, usually they go for around two and a half thousand. So it's an insane price. Um, okay, these are from the 80s. They are 24 karat gold gilded. They are the quilted classic button style earrings with that CC logo on the front. They're a great size for daytime. I also think as well, if you're looking to start out, okay, I'll do that for you next, Charles. Um, uh, if you're looking to start out a collection of you know vintage earrings, these were, I would say, like a great starting point, but also if you already have a collection, um, a nice kind of casual daytime wear as well. These can be, you know, dressed up and down. They work nicely in the day, but also in the evening as well. You can really dress them up by simply just, you know, putting your hair up, making these a nice focus of the outfit. You know, there's lots of ways that you can style earrings. They're in excellent condition. 24 karat gold, 80s, and they come with their box. We're going to auction these. I want you guys to get them again at the best, best price possible. Winnie's going to let us know the price and I'm going to show you what they look like on. I love playing dress up on these shows. Nice, secure fits. They have a nice, secure clip. These aren't going anywhere. Even if I shake my head, you can dance all night in these and they are going to stay nice and secure. Let me show you what they look like on. Nice button style, they're really beautiful. They're 80s, 24 karat gold, excellent condition and come with a box. So we're gonna auction them. We're gonna do a minute auction. 400, oh my goodness, I even feel like bidding in these. 450 pounds guys, you've got a minute and I've started my countdown. 450 pounds for real 24 karat gold Button earrings from the 80s. Oh, we've lost light. Okay. Oh, thanks, Echo. Okay, guys, you've got 30 seconds left. £450 for these. That is a starting bid. If we can please work an increment of £20. These would easily sell on the website for 595 That's kind of the standard rate for clip-on earrings. We've got a bid at £450 from Helena. And if you could please work with increment of 20 pounds. I'm gonna give it another 30 seconds, guys. Okay, May's our top bid at 480 pounds for these 80s clip-on button earrings, 480. You guys have got 20 seconds to get your bids in. We've got Michelle at 500, that's our top bid. You guys have got 15 seconds. I'm gonna start my countdown in five seconds. Okay, our top bid is 500 pounds currently from Chanel. I'm starting my 10 second countdown. We've got 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And I have to give it my little five seconds with my eyes closed. Okay. May is the winner at £520. Huge congratulations for your new 80s Chanel button earrings at £520. You've got 10 minutes to check out. Winnie's going to adjust that pricing. You've got 10 minutes to check out on those. Huge congratulations. Such a steal at that price, May. Um, congrats. Head on to checkout. So I think the, um, I think the black and... Um, I think the black and silver jumbo may have sold. If anybody's on here that could confirm that for me on the, on the LP team, Winnie, if you could have a, a little look for me, I think the black jumbo may have sold. 
So I'll pop that one out of the way as I think that has gone. Alison, I'm doing lots of I'm doing lots of auctions. I'm doing like a bit of a mix today. Um, Chrissy, I, I'm I wasn't planning on doing Hermes. I've had lots of requests for it though. So let me know what you guys are looking for. I've got Birkin that I've I've got four Birkin thirties in front of me. I've got one Mini Kelly and I've got one Kelly. Um, I've got blue, white, orange, red, and pink. It has sold. Congrats. Um, Today I wanted to do just kind of a last chance to purchase. Um, but again, if you guys are in the market for Birkins and Kellys, I'm more than happy to show. Um, I'm gonna do this one first. I think it was for Chelsea. Um, this is a vintage jumbo. Now, obviously when it comes to the different styles and the different classics, I have no Hermes or Anne's today. Um, they come in several slightly different sizes and variables. This is, you know, the classic jumbo size. This is in lambskin leather and it's finished with 24 karat gold because it's vintage. This is um, quite a structured flap actually. It's got two straps, like two chains. You can style it in different ways. And then we've got this nice big back pocket here, which is great for a phone, great for a small wallet. Um, nice turn lock opening at the front. <gasps> Congrats, Anne Christine. That price was insane. Um, nice single flap with that turn lock opening. And then the inside is lined with black lambskin. This comes with its box. Let's see if it comes with anything. Sorry, it comes with its um, dust bag. This is a three series, so it's 1994. It's 99. It's in really, really great condition. As you can see, the leather is nice and shiny. That gold hardware is nice and shiny as well. And there's, you know, minimal wear to this leather. The base is nice and clean. Corners are excellent. This is a really, really excellent condition piece. Um, I'd probably give it an eight, eight to nine out of 10 in terms of condition. Now this is what it looks like worn over the shoulder. And then when it's worn as a crossbody, you have that slightly longer drop, which is just not, that's very, very normal. Um, it doesn't come with its card, Chelsea. It comes with dust bag only. You've got that nice long strap at the front there that you can adjust and pull up so you can style it as a slightly shorter chain as well. Um, isn't it a great bag, Jazz? Honestly, I love this um, quite classic style actually from, from the 90s. A lot of the 90s classic flaps have that big CC at the front. This has that, you know, slightly smaller version, um, which makes the bag look more current season in my eyes actually because obviously you don't get that big cc anymore excellent condition it's a 1994 lambskin with 24 karat gold and when winnie's ready we will get the price up it's beautiful though so nice victoria beckham always carries hers as clutches underneath the arm which i think looks really chic and elegant as well And yeah, Linda, that's true. Normally they are burgundy inside. When they're not, it just means they're even more rare and would indicate, you know, this is a really great piece to invest in. Um, inside is all black. They only did that on several of the pieces. There was one year, early 2000s, that they did the, um, the Chanel classic flap with black inside. And they even still now sell at a premium. So when you do find that they do have the black lining inside, they tend to be slightly more rare as well. So that's a, yeah, that's another good point about this bag. Excellent condition. Looks great when you wear it with a strap on either shoulder. Yeah, such a good one. Jumbo is probably one of my most used bags, actually. I don't think it's too big for the evening as well. Like I'd absolutely wear this out to dinner. Um, looks amazing with this cardigan. <laughs> so this price is £5,250, which is US$6,457. And we're gonna cover your customs and duties, guys. This bag is pinned. It's a real special piece from 1994 with 24 karat gold. And you guys can find it through that icon in that top left-hand corner. Okay, up next guys, I have a boxed item from Louis Vuitton. 
This is a full set, so it would be a perfect gift for somebody at Christmas, or if you're obviously here, um, just in the market for things that come as a full set. This is box, dust bag, and ribbon, so we'll have it fully wrapped as if you were buying it straight from the store. And this is from the Twist collection. This is the Louis Vuitton Twist bag, which does actually come in a flat version, also comes in a tote bag version and a crossbody. The Twist basically gets its name from its closure at the front. So you'll see it says V for Vuitton, and then you twist that and it gives like the LV look for Louis Vuitton. This is in Epi leather in red. Um, which is absolutely beautiful. I know how stunning is this bag, Winnie? That red and silver combination for me is really classic. Red also goes with absolutely everything as well. And this is a great kind of, I'd say this is more of like an executive tote bag style, something that's nice for daytime. Um, Epi leather is really, really durable. It has this beautiful grain. They've actually placed the Epi diagonally. Usually Epi goes horizontal, but you'll see here they've turned it diagonally so you get that nice diagonal grain. Um, we've got clips on each side, so you can uh, actually make the bag slightly wider and even more spacious. It is lipstick red, yeah. And it comes with its key clochette, even comes with a crossbody strap as well. Sabrina, how amazing is this? Comes with a crossbody strap as well. Pristine condition, literally like barely any signs of wear. There's no scratches, scuffing or wear to the base. And then the inside, the bag only gets better. The inside's actually lined with navy, um, like a navy suede. Several compartments, one in the middle, two on each side, plus smaller compartments at the top there. Full set, guys, pristine condition. And adjustable straps on each side, so you can either make the bag bigger or smaller, depending on the occasion. Coming with everything. More of a current season style, a total classic, and a great work bag. Exactly, Linda. Makes a great executive work bag. I'm going to quickly get the measurements, and we will reveal the price. I love this as well, Sandy. I think it's really elegant. Let me just get the measurements, and we will get the price up. Okay. 12 inches wide. Oh, thanks, Winnie. 12 by 5 by 9 inches. So it's going to fit a laptop, like a small laptop or a MacBook. And it's also going to fit, you know, an iPad and a tablet, those kind of things. It's coming with everything. Box, dust bag, ribbon, pristine condition, epi leather from the Louis Vuitton Twist collection. Let's get the price up. That is actually a pocket, another pocket to the front as well. Oh, Maureen's on an aeroplane tuning in. Hi. <laughs> okay. Let's do it. Let's reveal the price. Absolutely love this. Perfect cherry red, navy interior, full set. Yeah, I can show one of those next for you, Chelsea, as well. Get the price up. Okay, one thousand nine hundred and ninety-five pounds for this Louis Vuitton Twist tote bag. In dollars, that's two thousand four hundred and fifty-three USD. And we're going to cover your customs and duties, guys. You can find this through the icon, which is pinned in that top left-hand corner. I have no stud earrings, Ali, unfortunately. Let me grab a bag for Chelsea. Let's do this one. Um, Winnie, I haven't reworked the pricing on this one, so I don't know if it might need slightly adjusting, um, but I'm gonna give you the skew. It's not part of the collection. This is PXL2350. Now this is, Chelsea, this is slightly bigger actually than the previous one. I'll show you them against each other. This is considered the maxi, but I have to show you because it's one of my all-time favorite bags. 
This really is the Holy Grail Vintage. Um, something I have in my personal collection and I absolutely love this bag. I think if I could have one Chanel bag, it would be this one. Um, it's just beautiful and such a collector's piece. Now this is crafted from black lambskin. It's quilted and we have that beautiful 24 karat gold hardware combination. We've got that nice big CC turn lock at the front and then a nice long double chain. Um, it has a really beautiful large, um, large link and looks absolutely beautiful when you wear it, which I'll show you shortly. We've got a nice big spacious pocket to the back. Good condition overall. I would say just some slight dullness to the corners. Remember, I'm standing in front of a really, really bright light and it really does heighten the look of wear. Um, but this has just slight dullness to the corners. Um, you know, just some light wear. I'd still give it, you know, a nice seven to eight out of 10 condition. One small scuff also to the base, but you can't really see that. Um, the front has minimal wear and there's minimal tarnish to the turn lock as well. Um, the skew on this, Winnie. PXL2350. It comes with a dust bag as well. And let's see if it comes with a card. Also comes with a card. So this is a dust bag and card situation. It's a two series, which makes it 1991 Chanel Maxi. This has the burgundy lining inside and the inside is in great condition. This particular style of dust bag was actually discontinued. These were designed to be almost like buffers to the leather. So you were told to wear it as a mitt. And then once the bag has been used, you can actually just insert the motions give the bag a massage and it actually softens and um, makes the leather really nice and shiny as well. I'm going to pop that back inside and then I'm going to show you guys how you can style this. Now, when I wear this, I, I usually just wear it, you know, classically over the shoulder. Um, it's actually surprisingly light. Um, the chain is obviously quite chunky, but the bag itself is quite light and it is a relatively comfortable bag to wear over the shoulder. With the chain, you can easily adjust it. It sits as a longer cross, just like most jumbos and um, maxis. But with this chain at the front, if you pull it through, fold it over, it does actually hold in place. So you can design the strap to be longer or shorter to your desired fit as well. Another way that I like to wear mine is actually like this. So if you cross the chain through the back, it will hold the chain in place and then you've got a slightly shorter chain um, to sit under the arm like this as well. You can really play around with it, it's amazing. Um, dust bag and card included, lamb skin with 24 karat gold, beautiful 1991 piece in good condition, just with some light wear to the corners, but I'd still give it, you know, a seven, eight out of 10. The front is nice and shiny and puffy and that, that beautiful gold hardware is absolutely stunning. Now, the price. Let's get the price up. Just so you guys know, these are discontinued. You can no longer buy these. These were designed by Karl Lagerfeld. He designed that nice big statement CC in the 90s. This became, you know, such an icon. Um, Victoria Beckham, she's very famous for her Chanel vintage collections. And there's pictures of her like literally clasping the bags at the top and wearing them as clutches. You can tuck the chain in, you can wear them under the arm. They wear so beautifully. And I don't know if you guys are like me, but I actually really enjoy a bag that looks slightly worn. Um, I just think it adds character. You know, it looks like you're using the bag. Um, obviously take caring of it, uh, of course, but I do like that slightly worn look, especially with vintage. Um, yeah, Linda, this is the maxi, but it's, it's a really, really great size. It does look so nice under the arm. It's so nice as a clutch. As mentioned, guys, I've got this in my personal collection and I love it. It does fit a small laptop inside. Personally, I wouldn't recommend wearing a laptop inside the bag. I do sometimes. Um, if I'm, you know, going to work and I really want to wear mine, I will just put my laptop in. But again, um, probably really wouldn't really recommend it. But if you need that, then you can do that. Maxi's bigger than the jumbo, yeah. Um, so, 4,000, I've got loads of clips coming, Michelle. I'll move on to some more jewelry soon. 4,500 pounds, which is 5,530 
five US dollars. We're gonna cover your customs and duties. That price, guys, on this is absolutely fantastic. You can even use Split It to check out and you can split the payment over the course of up to 12 months. If you guys wanna get your hands on this, it comes with a card, it comes with a dust bag, 1991 Chanel Maxi with 24 karat gold. You guys can shop it through the icon which is pinned in that top left-hand corner. Vivian, I don't have a flap but I do have a top handle. Let me do another pair of earrings and then I'll move on to the Mademoiselle piece that I've got available today. Uh, okay, let's do some more earrings. Let me give you a quick sneak peek. This is the Mademoiselle top handle that I have coming up. Stunning. Okay, the next item I am going to do is 42759301 Winnie. These are slightly more unique shape. Um, we're going to we're going to do an auction on these as well. These are from 1995. If you guys watch our shows, you will know just how iconic 1995 as a year for Chanel was. Um, you had the Barbie collection, you had all of these really, really collectible and iconic pieces coming out of that particular year. So these make a great investment piece. Another reason why these are really collectible is they are actually the four leaf clover design. So they're the four leaf clover style. And Coco Chanel was very, very superstitious as a person. She was into her, you know, lucky symbols. She was into her star signs. And the four leaf clover to her was considered a lucky symbol. So you'll see it featured throughout a lot of designs. Even still now, Chanel will use those particular designs. Um, but this is from, you know, 1995 during Karl Lagerfeld's era. They are so stunning. They're 24 karat gold. They are literally pristine, pristine condition. Um, they even have, you know, the um, cushions at the back, which are nice and clean and they're nice and clear. They're like a jelly and they make them really comfortable to wear. What you'll notice throughout the, sh throughout the clover, if you look closely, the light's like slowly dimming in here, guys. Apologies, I'm gonna invest in some new lights. Um, it actually says Chanel in lots of different um, places all the way around the backing. And then they've got the big CC logo in the center as well. Now I wanna auction these. I can flip it, Sandy, but the light, I literally, no light in here, let me show you. Oh, there we go, wow, they look stunning. Aren't they beautiful? Nineteen ninety five, twenty four carat, excellent, excellent condition. We're going to do an auction. I'm going to show you guys what these look like on. Okay, you have the necklace. Wow. What I would say is, if you are in the market to buy a pair of earrings today, okay, um, when you keep things together as a set, you can actually actually earn slightly more. Um, because you've obviously, you could sell them as a necklace and a pair of earrings as well. So when you do have a set, we always say try and keep them together because um, it can actually... Um, Lauren, if you want to head over to luxurypromise.com, I'm live there. You have to head over to the website in order to see the live. Um, this is what they look like on. We're going to start the auction. They do look like Van Cleef. They look like the Alhambra shape. They do, yeah. They're really comfortable. They're really secure. They're absolutely beautiful. Um, I'm going to do an auction on these. Let me show you again. Aren't they beautiful? I would buy these. These are one of my favorite pairs from 95. I think they're so... Oh, no worries, Laura. Head over. If you've got any questions, let me turn it slightly here. Um, Lauren, apologies. There we go. Um, okay, we're going to start the auction at 520 pounds. And we're going to start the auction now. You guys have got one minute. One minute. 520 pounds please bid in um increments of 20 pounds and go for it guys you've got just under a minute we've got sandy at 520 pounds <laughs> okay sandy was in there first at 520 if we could have increments of 20 pounds please we've got echo at 540 <laughs> we've got uh, CK at 560 Helena at 580 okay guys you've got 
about 40 seconds left, 35 seconds left. We've got Echo at 600. Okay, I'm gonna start my countdown in five seconds. We've got Jazz at 620. So I'm gonna start my countdown in three seconds. Okay, we've got 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And I'm gonna close my eyes for that five second delay. Okay, Carrie got that, Carrie Joy got that at 660 pounds. You guys, oh my gosh, <laughs> there's such a delay on my end. I think it was Carrie at 660. <laughs> wow, that price is amazing for these. Congratulations. Okay, Carrie, you got that. 660 pounds for these, huge congrats. They are such a collectible pair. We're going to adjust the pricing on the um, listing and you have 10 minutes to check out. If not, it will be Lou um, next up, but congrats. Wow, such an amazing pair. Do you guys want some more earrings? I have some more earrings. Let's do another pair. Uh, okay, let's do, oh, let's do these. These are beautiful. So, congratulations to uh, that lovely winner. Let's do another pair of earrings. So, um, Jazz got five, five pairs alone from LP. Jazz, I'd love to see your collection. So I'm gonna move on to probably one of my most favorite pairs of earrings actually. Um, they are slightly more unique and very, very collectible. These are from 1997 and they're actually a tortoiseshell and um, pearl combination. We're gonna do another auction. I'm gonna keep the auctions going guys because you're enjoying them. Um, let me flip the camera so you guys can see. I love these two Winnie. So these are a tortoiseshell combination with a grippoir pearl center. We've got that 24 karat gold gilded hardware, CC logo in the center, and then we've got that nice gold backing as well. And you can see it says 1997. Now these are in really excellent condition. There's no tarnish, there's no um, peeling to the pearl, and there's no tarnishing to the back. I'd say just some very light hairline scratches. If that, to be honest, they're actually in really, really amazing condition. Um, both of them are. How beautiful are these? These are a classic button style shape. So they are a nice day and evening size. The Gripoir, oh, thank you, Sandy. The Gripoir Pearl is a beautiful um, feature on these. I think they look absolutely beautiful. They give a really nice fresh look when you wear them. And tortoiseshell generally are really rare, actually. You don't actually come across them very often. Um, I just saw the earrings have checked out, so congratulations. This is what they look like on. Excellent condition. And Grippoir Tortoiseshell 24 karat gold hardware. Very, very collectible. 1997, again, those iconic years for Chanel. Um, they're absolutely beautiful. Anything with Tortoiseshell is really collectible. Slightly more rare and unique. Um, I absolutely love these. I really, really do. So we're going to do another auction because I'm enjoying them. And I think you guys are as well. And um, Winnie's going to set the price again. I'm sure the price is going to be insane. Um, everything is going to come with a Luxury Promise dust bag. And, oh, somebody on Instagram got the jumbo. Congratulations. Um, the Ma Oh, the maxi sold. Okay, amazing. This has sold. Congratulations. Oh, my goodness, who got it? Such a great piece. Okay. Love that bag so much. So, let's do it. Let's do another auction on these. 
tortoiseshell 24 karat gold they are beautiful beautiful collectible 1997 the light just does not do it justice let me flip the camera again i just love these so much okay so for these ones we're going to start the auction at 600 pounds i'm going to start my timer now you guys have got one minute to place a bid on these huge congratulations chelsea i'm so glad we managed to find you a bag today you guys have got one minute to auction um for these starting bid is 600 pounds and you guys have got uh, 45 seconds to place bids please work in increments of 20 pounds for these they are so beautiful. Who's into the tortoiseshell? I know me and Winnie love the tortoiseshell. I think it's so, so stunning. Um, okay, we've got 30 seconds. If anybody is in the market for some very rare, very special tortoiseshell earrings, place a bid now at 600 pounds. Remember, you could win the auction at the starting bid, 600, which would be insane, but that's how the auctions work. Um, 15 seconds, I'm gonna start my 10 second countdown. Now we've got 10, nine, eight seven six five four three two one okay let's keep moving on so let's move on to oh let's do a camera bag let's do a camera bag guys um, coming up, I've got this really, really special black caviar camera bag. Um, oh, thanks, Sandy. I'm glad you enjoy. I'm glad you enjoy enjoy the way that I do the auctions. Um, this is PXL one three seven seven. Can you flip one on a chain too? That would be cute, guys. You can clip one on a chain. Yeah, that's so true, Stevie. You can actually with the earrings. Um, this is, I'm so into camera bags at the minute. I don't know about you guys. I think they're such a great everyday style. They're practical. They're slightly more unique and they're just really, really easy to wear and they look so beautiful. This is black caviar. We've got big CC logo at the front in that diamond stitch quilting, matelas stitching all the way through for that classic quilting look. This has got a nice spacious front pocket, which actually has a magnetic closure as well. This is a three series, so it's 1994 to 1996. It's in excellent condition, and that's because of the beautiful uh, caviar leather. It's really durable, great for everyday wear. Oh no, uh, Chelsea, there's no odor to the bag. No, I'll double check, but no, I, I usually, I can really, really smell it and there's not, and we don't usually tend to show bags um, with odor. So yeah, don't worry about that. It definitely doesn't. Um, corners on this are really excellent. It is a 24 karat gold hardware. So we've got that nice shiny gold ball attached here with that CC logo. That's actually attached to the zipper, which works really easily. It's nice and smooth. Um, and then this is, coming with i don't think this comes with anything doesn't come with anything but the serial code is fully intact and to be honest that's all you need really can you hear all the traffic outside <laughs> new york never sleeps let me tell you i hear that noise all night um the strap on this is super comfortable i like a slightly wider strap as well especially in the daytime i think it looks really really elegant um, and it sits just on the hip like this. This is more of a medium st uh, size. Um, so it's great for daytime. It's gonna fit, you know, you could potentially fit an iPad in here. You could fit like uh, a wallet, a phone, you know, all of your daily essentials. Um, Winnie's hit you guys with the measurements as well. 11 and a half by 3.25 by eight inches. So yeah, consider the medium, nice strap comfortable on the shoulder it's so light to wear the caviar leather is durable it's great for everyday use it's so light to carry and i just love this honestly this is such a great black classic the price is going to be amazing um and i want to show you guys the inside we'll get the price up very shortly inside is lambskin several pockets you've got one here and you've got another one there um it's beautiful it really, really is. The price is gonna be insane. Um, yeah, definitely a unisex piece. The strap has a knot on the, the top here, which sits nicely over the shoulder. This is what it looks like 
worn non-crossbody, just classically over the shoulder. Showing again the base. Nice and clean. Isn't it stunning? I love this. I'm definitely looking for a camera bag soon for myself. I think it's just a perfect, perfect every day. Okay, the corners on this are great. I'm gonna show you close up. Minimal wear to the corners. I did just slightly dull to this one, but it's um, it's not too, too worn at all. Um, there's no wear on this one, this one, there's no wear. It's actually just that one corner. Yeah, exactly, Echo. I'd use this as in my everyday, easy, you know, work bag, daytime bag, lunch bag. Um, it's just a perfect all occasion piece. And there's not too much going on. You've got that nice logo at the front. Um, the gold hardware is quite subtle on this as well. So yeah, it's a really, really beautiful bag. Um, so yeah, we'll wait for the price on this beautiful, beautiful camera bag. It's so good. Um, Hilla, so we do, so when an item first comes in at Luxury Promise, we do like a conditioning um, stage. So the bag goes through all of the buyers, the bags are, you know, emptied out if there's anything left inside. They go through a really thorough quality control check. So once we show the items on the screen, they are already, they've already kind of gone through that process. Um, yeah. Uh, want to know when the next time to condition my new flap will be. Um, the earrings haven't been checked out. Uh, the earrings I think have. Which ones, Vanessa? So this is 18.95 today, guys. Amazing, 18.95 pounds, which is 2,330 US dollars. Amazing price. We're gonna cover your customs, your duties, we ship worldwide, and you guys can check out with Split It on this. You can split the order over the next 12 months, and this will be shipped out to you within a couple of days. That price for caviar is honestly so, so amazing. We will definitely never have you know a price like that again. Absolutely beautiful. Um, yeah, the earrings, I saw the earrings got checked out, I think. Oh, the, the 520 quilted. Uh, yeah, go for it. If you want to grab those, go for it. If they've not checked out, it has been 10 minutes. Um, and if you guys want this, it is pinned in that top left-hand corner. Mm. Can you hear the Christmas music? <laughs> New York is so Christmassy. I didn't know what I was like expecting because I've never been here for Christmas. Like I thought London was Christmassy until I got to New York, actually insane. Um, so again, Hattie, today I wasn't planning on showing Hermes bags. If there's something in particular you're looking for, if you could let me know in the comments. Um, but today I'm doing like my, your last chance to get these pieces. So today wasn't really Hermes based, but if you're looking for something specific, I'd rather you just let me know rather than me pulling out random pieces. Um, no, it was in the background, Sandy. I've got more earrings, Echo. I'll do one more pair, and then that is all of the earrings today. This next pair are stunning. <laughs> Hattie, I've got um, orange, red, blue, and white in Birkin 30s. Let me know what color. Oh, I've also got gold as well. Gold, orange, red, blue, and white. Um, let me know what colour you're into and I can pull it out for you. Okay, the last pair of earrings, guys. Um, Stevie, my mum made me watch Elf with her the day before I left London. So I watched Elf like last week and I want to watch it again. <laughs> it's, it's literally my favourite. Um, so these are from 1998. They are like a marble grey finish 
matte gold 24 karat gold hardware and then they've got this beautiful like gray blue marble oval shape which sits on the ear these are beautiful they really really are um sure hattie i can show you that it is with silver hardware palladium hardware so let me know if that works for you um let me flip the camera on these because they are just so beautiful they have like a marble marble look blue and gray 24 karat gold hardware with a like a matte finish and these are in excellent excellent condition there's no tarnish they are really a beautiful beautiful pairings i'm going to just put the price up for these guys i'm not going to auction them because i've got you know just about around about 20 minutes left and it's also super late for winnie so i'm not going to run over um 20 minutes left yeah, they go so nicely with, with this top, actually. This top's available, guys, for you to shop. If you want to check out on this, it was $7.95. It's a Chanel cashmere cardigan. This is what they look like on. They are excellent condition, $19.98. They are so beautiful. They're nice and secure. This is the kind of pair of earrings that you, you know, I think look really nice with a nice hair updo. I'd probably do a nice bun with these so the earrings, you know, really show off. Oh, thanks, Winnie. The stone is lapis lazuli, and it's like a grey blue, and it looks like a marble. It's beautiful. Um, the Alma uh, Stephanie, I'll do for you next. There we go. This is what they look like on. I think these are stunning. I love colour jewellery. Like I'm so into like the more colourful pieces now. Um, I have like lots of colours in my ears, and I really, really love. Like I'm always drawn to the more coloured pieces from Chanel. I think it's just fun. Um, no need gold hardware. Oh, Hattie, okay. Um, just so you know, I'm doing a full MS show on Tuesday. Um, it will be 4.30 till 6.30 Eastern time, which in London, that's 9.30 to 11.30. So definitely tune in for that. We're gonna have lots available. In the meantime, we're gonna get these pinned. This is the last pair of earrings, guys, just to be clear. This is the last pair I have on today's show. And we're not gonna auction these. We're just gonna set the price for these ones so beautiful love them yeah these go so nicely with the cardigan actually you're right okay these are 750 pounds which is 922 us dollars with customs and duties covered, guys, that's an amazing price. We ship worldwide. And if you want to get your hands on these, just click on that icon, which is in the top left-hand corner of your screen. Let's do the Alma, because we've had someone patiently waiting. Okay. Aren't they stunning? So this is the only Alma bag I have left in New York. This is the last, last one. Um, this is the, I think this is the medium size. Um, and it's in the classic monogram coated canvas. We've got that beautiful dark honey patina leather. And then the base is like slightly worn. We've got maybe some very light watermarks, but you know, considering it's in a really, really good condition, that honey colored leather, I absolutely love. Um, uh, Louis Vuitton leather is designed to go darker over time um, and that's how you get this nice honey colored look um, really really great condition piece slightly worn in places to the base but that's kind of what Louis Vuitton is designed to do it's designed to age over time it's designed to have that you know slightly worn look and I think it just adds character okay we can auction this one okay Winnie we can auction it um, I'd say slight wear to the um hardware just some slight um tarnish again very common for louboutin and with this particular one you can add a strap if you wanted to onto either side of the um of each handle it's a perfect in the arm fit and i'll show you the uh, inside whilst we set the auction price let's have a look Okay, so inside is excellent. Inside, 
Canvas is in great condition. Handles are nice and clean. And let's do an auction. This is, you know, this is such a classic. Louis Vuitton has several classics. I'd say like, you know, the Alma, the Speedy, the Neverfall, the Keepall, those are like the real classics for the House of Louis Vuitton. We also have the Ellipse, quite similar to the Alma, rounded shape, which was discontinued. The Alma is readily available to shop in Louis Vuitton, but they sell for over 2000 pounds brand new now. And you guys are gonna be like obsessed with the price. We're starting, oh my goodness. That is not even the price of a wallet. We're gonna start the auction at 450, oh, that's just gone, hang on. Let me wait for Winnie to confirm the price. What, even less? Okay, we're gonna start the auction at 420 pounds, guys. You've got one minute, that has just begun now. Please work up in increments of 50 pounds for bags. 420 pounds, starting bid for this Louis Vuitton. Um, actually, we can do 20s. Increments of 20 because it's under a thousand. You guys have got 45 seconds to place bids. 420 pounds or above for this Louis Vuitton Alma. Classic monogram. Coated canvas. Great condition. 35 seconds left, guys. 420 pounds is the starting bid. This is what the bag looks like on. It is absolutely beautiful. You guys have got 20 seconds. I'm gonna start my countdown in 10 seconds. Guys, 420 pounds for this bag. It retails over 2,000 pounds. Like, this is insane. Condition is great. Chrissy, it does not come with a strap. Here we go. Okay, I'm gonna start my 10 second countdown. Now, you guys have got 10, nine, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and I'm going to give you guys five seconds. Stephanie got that. Stephanie got that at 600. Stephanie, oh my gosh, this was an insane price. Congratulations, 600 pounds. Stephanie, you're the winning bid. You've got 10 minutes to check out at 600 pounds for the Louis Vuitton Alma bag. And Chrissy, thank you so much, thanks. Uh, 600 pounds, go for it. You've got 10 minutes to check out. Could I just confirm as well, the last earrings, I know I have to look away because I want it to be as fair for you guys as possible. So if I cover my face and then the last one on the screen, for me, that's, that's, that's I feel like the fairest way for me to do it. Can I confirm that the lapis clip-ons have also sold? I think I saw a sale come through for the, those. So let me know if that is confirmed. Okay. Yeah. Right. They did sell. Um, yeah, I went darker with my hair, Chrissy. yeah. <laughs> um, speedy bags, I do. Let's do that one next. I've got a really special limited edition Speedy. Um, it's pinned for you, Steph, up there. Stephanie, sorry. I keep, like, shortening all your names. <laughs> I hope that doesn't offend you guys. Um, okay, let's do AWL1703. We're going to move on to a limited edition style of Speedy bag. Uh, we're moving on from one classic Louis Vuitton to another classic. Up next, we are moving on to... Winnie, you'll have to remind me what artist collaboration this was. I can't quite remember. Um, but this is a classic Speedy 30 bag. This is crafted from Louis Vuitton's classic and iconic... Oh my gosh, Lou, congrats! Such amazing earrings. Um, this is crafted from Louis Vuitton's classic coated canvas. And then we have this beautiful, almost like a coral... It looks like coral to me, like a coral design throughout the bag in pink, red, and orange. This is in excellent, excellent condition. We've got light honey patina, um, nowhere to the base, nowhere to the corners. Maybe just some light wear here on this corner, actually. Just some light wear around the edging there. Let me show you the inside. There's no tarnish. Oh, thank you, Winnie. So this is the Ramage Grenade designed by Nicholas. I'm not gonna try and pronounce that last name <laughs> you guys can see it on screen 
The inside is like a pink canvas. You can move that label. 2015 collaboration. <laughs> um, 2015, inside is immaculate. I would give this, you know, a good eight out of 10 condition rating. We do have some light wear on one of the corners. Let me show you the corners but the paint really hides it it almost looks like part of the design actually now as this is limited edition these do sell for um slightly higher than the classic monograms um but they're still under retail you know anything in louis vuitton now is above the like two thousand pound mark um so i want to get the price up of this one uh shortly we're not going to auction this guys this will be a set price because it is a limited edition artist collab um, so the price on this one will be set, but we'll obviously do you guys the best price possible. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. I just saw the, the Alma check out, so congrats, Stephanie. Um, I love this. This is, you know, this is classic meets um, unique and rare, which I really love. I love the color on this. This color can transform you, uh, transition all season. And if you want something just a little bit special, something a bit more elevated, this is a great piece to go for. It's a 30, Linda. Yeah, it's a classic 30 style. Comes with a padlock, light patina leather. Love this dark, rich color against the handles. So good. I love elevated pieces, something that's a bit unique. You know, this is a conversation starter. You can do some research on the history of the artist and the collection and, you know, hit your friends with the facts when they ask you, where did you get it? What, what, like, tell me more about this bag. This is £1,595, which is 1,961 US dollars. Great, great price. Thanks, Chrissy, for clarifying that. It is great price, amazing colors, Linda. Limited edition, collectible, something that will only go up in value because it was a limited edition piece. Great price. I'm glad you guys are happy with the pricing today. If you want to get your hands on this, it is pinned in that top left-hand corner. You can use Split It to check out. If you wanted to split the payment, it would be just over £100 a month. Insane. Um, and there she is. Oh, Stephanie, I'm so glad I could help you find something you were looking for. So that one is up. Um, we do also have a... What else shall I do? Let's do the key pool. Let's do the key pool next. Just get the label off. Okay, right. Moving on through all the classic Louis Vuitton pieces. Coming up, I've got this beautiful classic Keeple 55 bag from Louis Vuitton. You guessed it. Um, the Keeple bag is the I most iconic, um, you know, best, best travel bag, in my opinion, for anyone. This is also something that you can, you know, use within the household. Okay, we can auction this as well. Something that can be used within the household for everyone. It's unisex. It fits a lot in. The 55 size is also the size that you can carry on an airplane as well. So this makes a great weekend bag, a gym bag, a travel bag, airplane bag, you guys name it. You can use this for everything. It's crafted from the canvas, Louis Vuitton's monogram coated canvas, which is super lightweight. And the keeple comes in two, two styles. You have the classic keeple, then you also have the bandolier. This is the classic, so it was not designed with a strap. Just to be clear, there's no strap missing as it was not designed to come with one this has really lovely honey patina um, I don't have any clothes today Michelle no um, it's just this one that I had on clothing will be uh, throughout the week as well and these are ship rays ship ray sandals I know Sean at the bag's huge it's 55 centimeters wide um, and you've got this nice honey honey colored patina leather um, I'd say just, you know, some light wear in places. We've got some light watermarks. But as I mentioned, Louis Vuitton was designed to age and, you know, you know, wear over time. That's kind of the look of the bag. Now, let me show you the inside. Inside is immaculate. No staining to the base. Handles are nice and clean. And honestly, it looks huge, but it's so lightweight. You show the base again and this is going to be another bag that we're going to auction um, it has a like a luggage tag as well so you can tie the handles together 
Um, it sits nicely over the arm, easy to carry, and these bags are really designed to last you a lifetime. This is something you know you'll have have in your wardrobe forever. Another great thing about the keyboards is they're actually designed to flat pack. So let's say I don't know. I always set the scene in in one way here. Like I'm going to Paris for the weekend with the girls. I know I'm going to be shopping a lot and I want to carry a bag in my luggage with me so that I can fill it up with all my things that I buy, carry it with you, you can. These flat packs so perfectly into a suitcase. If you are traveling, you're going on a girl's trip, you're shopping, these flat packs so perfectly so you can you know, carry extra luggage with you for really, really easily as well. So in, in retail, like these are 1,830 pounds from the store. We're gonna start an auction on this. Um, Sarah, I had one small Louis Vuitton bag earlier, the red one that's still available. You can find that underneath the handbag icon. We're going to auction this, guys, just to confirm it's a size 55. Um, Vivian, I do have a graffiti speedy, not with me right now. It will be back this week. Um, I'll have some more of those this week. So, we're going to auction this, guys. Keeble 55. We're going to start the auction at £550 starting from now. You guys have got a minute to bid. £550 for this. They retail for £1,830. Please bid in increments of, uh, I would say, probably, yeah, 20 Um, It doesn't have a dust bag, Sandy, no. I can give you a luxury promise one, though. Okay, so we're in, we're in for like 15 seconds so far. You guys have got 45 seconds to make a bid. Starting bid is £550. Ali, I showed a speedy 25 at the start of the show. If you guys want to place your bids on this, we've got Mary in at 550. You guys have got 30 seconds to go. We've got £550 from Mary. Remember guys, these retail for 1800 So like that price is absolutely absolutely insane you guys have got 30 seconds we've got batari in at 575 and we've got 25 seconds left 595 from vivian 610 okay i'm going to start my 10 second countdown in three two one we've got 10 9 8 Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and then I have to give five seconds. Okay. Mary is the winner at six hundred and ten pounds. Mary, congratulations! That really, that price is amazing. Congrats, Mary. Six hundred and ten pounds. You've got 10 minutes to check out. So we've got about eight minutes left, guys, and then it is time to call it a day. So now would be a great opportunity to let me know if you want me to recap anything I've shown you throughout today's show. Have a click on the handbag icon, which is at the bottom part of your screen. It's gonna give you a full list of everything I've been through so far. Let me know if you want me to recap anything. We've, I've seen some requests. We have one Louis Vuitton bag, two Louis Vuitton bags left. We've got the LV Twist Tote, and we've also got the Louis Vuitton Speedy. Um, we have one pair of earrings left. Speedy 25 was also in there in navy leather. Um, I'm going to show a couple more pieces and then we're going to call it a day. So let me do, oh, what do you guys, right. I'm going to ask you guys what you want to see. Um, Sue, you want me to recap the Chanel Jumbo, this one that I showed, that I showed earlier. Let me quickly recap the tortoiseshell earrings as well. So the tortoiseshell earrings were 1997. They are tortoiseshell around the edge, gripoir pearl, and they've got that beautiful CC logo. They are in excellent condition. No Birkins today sell. Um, excellent condition. Super collectible. 
and absolutely stunning. One of my favorite pairs of earrings. I'll show you the Chanel Jumbo as well. Chelsea, which, um, which Chanel do you want to re-see? Um, guys on Instagram, if you head over, if you read the caption, it says luxurypromise.com, we're live. If you head over to the website, you'll be able to see the live. Okay, this is the Jumbo. This is a vintage lambskin, 24 karat gold hardware. We've got the small CC logo, beautiful leather and twine chain, and this is what the bag looks like on. This was in absolutely beautiful condition. The leather is puffy. It comes with its dust bag, and also comes with, I'm sure it came with its, yeah, it comes with its dust bag, and is a 90s Chanel classic jumbo. It's absolutely beautiful. Condition on this was excellent. Minimal wear to the corners. Shiny, puffy lambskin leather throughout. Beautiful big CC logo at the front. I'm gonna show you guys. This is a great bag, honestly. This is such a great bag. Um, it's probably going to be the last item. I love, okay, this with this this outfit, it looks so good. This is listed as, uh, Sue, let me show you the corners. Here we go. Corners are really good on this. There we go. It's so good. Honestly, it's such a good one. And just one thing to point out, usually with the vintage flaps, the inside's burgundy. This one has a black lambskin lining, which makes it quite rare and very, very collectible as well. So that was a great one. Um, this next piece is actually listed as dark green, but I don't see any green in this. It is definitely more of a charcoal gray to me. Um, yeah, I can show you the inside. Inside is excellent. There we go inside is excellent several pockets nice shiny lambskin slight press mark here but that can easily be massaged out of the bag really really beautiful coming with its original dust bag sticker is fully readable yeah it's three nine seven seven eight six six three nine seven seven eight six six it's a three series, 1994 to 1996. This is available, Jane. This is pinned. You guys can find it here. This is available, 5,250 pounds. Black lambskin jumbo from 1994 with 24 karat gold hardware. Really is, you know, the most classic, one of the most stunning bags ever. It's just the, it's the bag to have, like, you know, that jumbo classic flap, super beautiful. Um, there we go. Okay, moving on to this one. This is a nice, this is like a really, really nice bag coming up. Um, this is actually a silver hardware combination. This looks very 2000s to me. I'll double check the year in a second. And it's actually a naturally distressed leather. So you'll see the leather has like some slight wrinkling. It's a dark gray, so it goes really nicely with this sweater also in some lights can be seen as like a black as well um this has a big cc logo at the front distressed leather classic quilting silver hardware leather entwined chain around the back we've also got a nice big back pocket perfect for a phone perfect for a wallet and then we have this nice larger style flap is PXL 1133. Um, and then the inside, it's a single flap. Inside is lined with like a gray satin. Get ready for the price on this one. This is so amazing. If you're in the market for an easy kind of, you know, classic everyday bag, something that is really, really well priced, this is it. Or if you're in the market for your first Chanel, this is it. Let me tell you, the price is so, so amazing. I would honestly buy this. I think it's fabulous. Um, the series on this is a 13 series, which I think is 2010, roughly, ish. Yeah. Um, single chain allows you to style this over the shoulder. I mean, look at this color with this jacket. 
I love it. It has a slightly higher higher drop. So it does go as a cross. It sits just under the hip, um, under the, the uh, chest. Um, you can, you know, you can wear it comfortably as a cross, but actually the chain's probably more suitable to be worn as just an over the shoulder flap. This distress look on the leather for me is like so stunning. I love it. Also makes the bag really durable as well. Um, and this is very, very 2000s, which is, you know, so on trend right now. Um, condition wise is excellent. The leather, as I've mentioned, is naturally distressed. So it has that natural distress look. That is actually a crease in the leather. It's not where it's supposed to look like that. And another good thing about this leather as well is it makes it a really durable bag and less wear will show up actually when you wear this. Um, so yeah, there we go. Full flap, big CC logo. It doesn't come with a card, Sarah, no. But again, that will have been factored into the card serial code intact it's beautiful and we'll get the price up there we go yes they are tea Customs and duties are covered, yes, to the UK. Okay, this price is 1,000, <laughs> let's just start with two at least, 1,795 pounds, which is 2,207 US dollars. We cover your customs, we cover your duties, guys. We're shipping worldwide. This is a great, great bag. If you love a classic flat, you love class, you know, you love those classic styles, you want just a real nice classic chanel bag this price is unbeatable you can also use split it it will be just over 100 pound a month if you want to get your hands on this you guys can click on that link which is in the top left hand corner and there are several payment methods that you can use to check out this will be the last item of the day guys when you need to go to bed it's super late in london um so now's a, a great time to ask if you guys have any other questions i'm going to be live twice a day for the next week i'm going to be on instagram at 11 a.m uh, Eastern time and Sue message me yeah of course you can send me a message and then I'm going to be live 4 30 to 6 30 um Eastern time every day so you guys will see me live lots this week we've got new stock coming as of tomorrow um thank you so much Winnie for moderating my show congratulations to those of you who made some purchases well done you've got some great prices today I hope you guys have a lovely rest of your evening and weekend and I'll see you guys in the morning. See you soon. Bye for now. Bye.